Hey, what's good YouTube? Wybit here. I want to do this quick video, kind of give you a, a, an update that I just found out today. And I apologize uh, off the top if the audio and, and video is suspect. Uh, that's not really important. What is, is this breaking news, so to speak, that uh, I just found out today that actually came out, I think, uh, around the 1st of February. Um, so quickly, the backstory on this is if you have uh, a MacBook, an iMac, a Mac Mini, uh, and you have two home pods uh, right now as it stands you can't through those devices pick the home pods that plays a stereo pair without a workaround I've got a video I'll put in the description uh, that actually still works that I put out back in December um, that basically shows you how to get it to work it's wonky um, and it's it's a bit of a pain but it is a workaround uh, that has been fixed with Big Sur 11.3 beta. Now I'm going to talk about a couple things after I show you this before you jump into doing this, um, but know that finally, uh, which I believe has been something years that we've been waiting for, for those of you that, that you know, for me it's been just a few months, but I know others have been waiting longer. All right, let's get into it. So again, to confirm, there is uh, Mac OS Big Sur, the latest 11.3 beta, as you can see there in the top. And I've got a, a little video. I'll play some sample audio here in a second. And then in the sound uh, preferences, I've got the Office uh, AirPlay selected. I'll explain why you see different things there. And um, I've got the left HomePod here. And then I've got the right HomePod over there. And what I'll do is when I play this, I'll put the microphone uh, kind of up there so you can kind of see. Also, then what I'll do is I'll restart the computer. Um, just to show you kind of, you know, what happens. Um, it is a still a little buggy and wonky. I'll kind of point a few things out, um, but it's nice to see that they got this fixed. So let me go ahead and turn up the volume a little bit here, and let's bring the microphone over to, we've got the uh, left home pod, and we'll go over to the right. So there you go. We've got audio coming out, and as you can see, I can control the volume with the, uh, keyboard. Now I noticed a few times when I go all the way down to mute, I, I still would hear some audio. So again, it's not without uh, some bugs. There also is a delay. So when I go ahead and hit um, the pause, there's that delay still when I hit play. So that is still there and that's something that hopefully um, they will fix. Um, I, I can't speak to um, if we're going to see like drops after, you know, 5, 10, 15, 20 minutes. Again, I just got this thing working about 20 minutes ago. Um, so those still may exist. Um, but again, if you've seen the video that I did before, it is nice to know that we don't have to do the workaround. Let me uh, switch over the speakers, kind of show you in real time uh, what happens here. So I'm going to go ahead and select the MacBook Air speakers, and we'll just kind of... And let's switch back over to the home pods. You're going to have that delay. But there we go. We got the left plan. And we got the right plan. So there you go. So what I want to do right now is let me go ahead and um, I just want to restart. Uh, let's shut this down, restart. All right, so we're going to restart this again. I just want to do this just to show you that I'm not doing any of the workarounds um, that you might have seen in the previous video. So um, it's, it's again, it's a great thing to see that they finally done this. Uh, as this is booting up here, uh, the one thing that I, again, remind you, you probably already know this, um, but please don't install this on your main computer. <laughs> this is something that you should do if you have um, a, a spare one, you just never want to put uh, this on here. So that's my recommendation. I, I think for uh, many of us, we kind of know that. Um, but if you're like, if you want to rush out and do this, um, I, I would highly encourage you to do this on a backup or a spare one um, because I had some issues, and I'll, I'll kind of walk you through that. So let me go ahead and uh, pull this up. And I just want to show you that. You, you do have to make a selection um, again. So by default, let me come to the uh, sound preferences here. And by default, it still has the Mac Airbook speakers. So I'll just go ahead and pull up 
YouTube again here and play the video again so it's coming through the um, speakers in the, uh, Air, the Airbook, Mac Airbook so let's go ahead and switch over this time I'll just do it from the drop down select the home pods kind of saw a little buggy there with the volume but we got left and we got right so you know there it is I mean it's finally <laughs> I mean, this this I, I'm I'm kind of in shock because I, I didn't expect that Apple would do this. Um, I, I've seen them kind of take time with things. I, I know they have more impressing things, but this is a big thing for those of us that you know have this set up. Um, again, please, um, if you have um, only one main computer, I wouldn't recommend doing this. So I did this on this MacBook Air. This is an M1 MacBook Air, um, and I already had my home pods on my network and it didn't work. Matter of fact, it froze up all my sound. Anything that had sound, uh, MP3 file, uh, YouTube website, uh, I, I couldn't even select MacBook speakers. So what I had to do is I had to basically unplug the home pods, um, take them off the network, reinstall this beta version on the MacBook, go through it the entire process and, and start them as new and it worked. Um, so again, I'm not suggesting <laughs> you do this at your own risk. Um, the article that I read in Mac Rumors said that it was a, a bit buggy, um, so I'll have to continue to play with it. You know, let it run for you know half a day or something to see if we're getting those dropped issues. But this is a good thing, um, and I, I wanted to throw this together for you real quick. I apologize if the audio and the video was crappy. It's more about the content. Um, so if you are someone that runs the beta, you want to try it out. You've got a spare you know, a laptop or, or something that you can try it, give it a shot um, and see if it works for you um, and leave me your results, um, how it's working for you in the comments. Um, but otherwise, I don't know when this is going to come out. Um, if I can find some information, I'll put that in the description. And again, if you, you know, can't do the beta, then check out the link that I have of the workaround video if you want that as an option but it's great to see now I can't speak to the HomePod minis I don't own any I so I, I don't have that answer for you um, if that works with the minis uh, for those of you that might have that that setup so um, just have to kind of follow the the, the news and, and kind of see what happens so I hope this helps uh, feel free to, to to leave a question and I'll do my best if it's something that I can answer um, but I wanted to kind of give you a, a quick and simple demonstration that hey you know it's coming um, and, and, and that's a great thing. Unfortunately, as you can tell in the back, I, I got these <laughs> these Clippers speakers that uh, had I just waited a few more days, I probably wouldn't need them. But uh, this is a good thing. So anyway, that's all I got. I uh, hope this helped and uh, we'll catch you in another video. Uh, be safe out there.